All right, hey everybody, Mark Burgess here at Big East Bass Fishing. Appreciate you turning into the channel and uh, subscribing, following, sharing it, like it. I see a lot of people have been doing that lately and I really appreciate it. So this is a follow-up video to getting started in bass fishing. I thought I'd just mention some of the equipment that you're gonna need uh, without getting too detailed into baits and things like that, that'll, that'll come. I've done some videos uh, or previous to this on soft stick bait, colors, things like that, spinner baits. So kind of like look back in the channel a little bit, see if you can find some of those that'll help you out. But we're gonna talk about the equipment to get started. Um, I'm gonna recommend um, a spinning rod and a, and a bait casting rod. 6.6 six to 6.8, six, 6.10 on both of them, medium heavy, fast tip, okay? Um, they're gonna do a lot of things for you and it's something that you're not gonna grow out of. You're just gonna add to this, they'll become part of your equipment going forward, okay? Almost like golf clubs, okay? You're just gonna basically complete a set, but this you're gonna start off with a spinning rod and a, and a bait casting rod, 6.6 six to 6.8, six, 6.10, six, medium heavy, fast tip, okay? Reel-wise, on the spinning rod, you wanna look for a 2500 series spinning reel, Middle of the road, okay? So you want infinite anti-reverse, a good drag. Don't buy the cheapest reel out there. Don't buy the most expensive. Pick the middle of the road. Um, certainly Shimano, Daiwa, Abu, Luz. Those, I mean, there's a, there's a lot of others, of course, but those four right there, middle of the road, you're gonna get a quality product um, that a lot of people have used and, and they'll stand behind, okay? Bait casting. Um, you want to get something in the six, two to one, up to seven to one to one gear ratio. And you're going to want to decide what side the reel handle needs to be on. The spinning reel is going to come by default on the left, although you can change it. But the bait caster, you have to decide. You can't interchange um, left hand retrieve, right hand retrieve. I'm right handed, so I reel with my left hand. Okay, I realized years ago, 30 something years ago, that my spinning reel handle was on the left, not, and that was very comfortable. Why was my bay casting reel handle on the right? So I switched and uh, never looked back. Okay, it's just much more efficient, faster reaction time with hook sets and things like that. It's just more comfortable. If you're right handed, you know, left hand retrieve and vice versa if you're left handed. All right, so th that's the gear ratio and that's a, the real handle side that you should be purchasing. Um, those will make nice balanced outfits for you. Line size, basically the spinning rod, I'm going to throw, I don't like to throw less than six, but some people throw four pound test, but six to 10 pound test on the spinning reel and anywhere from 10 to 20 to 25 on the baitcaster. Okay, so reels and line have come a long way over the years, line diameter, things like that. Um, even with braid, you can get 12 pound diameter braid and that you can put a fluorocarbon leader on, if you will. But if you're fishing off color water, you can tie direct to that, to that braid. Um, same thing with the baitcaster, you can put some mono backing on it and go braid to a liter if you want. Um, I still fish uh, monofilament, um, braid, and fluorocarbon, depending on what I'm doing, okay? So uh, we'll get into that here in, in a little bit in subsequent videos. And like I said, you know, as far as baits goes, you can look back in my channel and you can you can see soft plastic and colors, um, how not to get sucked into buying every color under the sun. We'll talk about spinner baits, we've talked about some crank baits and things like that, so. Um, this is just to get you started in the equipment uh, side once you do join a bass club and those guys are going to have a lot of uh, recommendations for you as well. So again, Mark Burgess, Big East Bass Fishing. Thanks for tuning in. I appreciate it and we will definitely see you on the water.